In the space of science and enormous advantages of knowledge, the subject of what existed early on and the enormous effect has mixed discussions and captivated characters for a long time. This Goliath demand doesn't simply test how we could unravel the universe. It challenges the certifiable farthest objectives of human information. Imagine standing at the edge of existence, analyzing the enormous shadowing, and considering what lay there before our universe was envisioned. The event of the enormous detonation marked the start of history, space, and what we know. In any case, there was a moment sooner, ahead of time. This may have been, there, in the end, may have been a state of nothingness, a quiet before the grandiloquent gathering began. And if this is authentic, was it? Or maybe there was something altogether more disturbing that existed before time itself. As we jump further into this solicitation, science takes us on an excursion past the universe's early phase into considerations that challenge our care. Physicist Brian Cox, known for his obligation to the marvels of the universe, proposes that something stunning could have existed before the Big Bang. He moves us to reconsider our thinking of the certifiable world and presence. In this assessment, we'll explore the science, the hypothesis, and the astonishing insider secrets that could figure out what existed prior to all that. We'll investigate thoughts like genuine improvement, quantum changes, dark energy, and even multiverses. The responses we've uncovered may very well smother you but they could also open new understandings of our situation in the universe. Plan to jump deep into a world beyond imagination and science, where the dark still winds around the shadows, leaving researchers stunned and, at times, even steamed. Let's analyze what existed before the Big Bang and why these speculations challenge all that we anticipated we knew to appreciate. What could have existed before the Big Bang? We first need to take a gander at what the Big Bang in reality was. The Big Bang, as researchers describe it, alludes to the event when the universe became phenomenally hot and thick, growing quickly to set off the arrangement of all matter, energy, and endless powers. When we look toward the night sky, we see proof of this hot starting, with systems fanning out from a beginning point. In any case, what reason did this happen? Was there a period before this thick, hot beginning? As shown by the theory of infinite expansion, there was beyond a shadow of a doubt a preceding, and it was off by a wide margin to void. On the other hand, calm, grandiose expansion proposes that before the Big Bang, the universe was in an express that was cold, empty, and free, on a very basic level, like a legendary vacuum. In any case, the vacuum wasn't totally unfilled. It contained a tremendous sum of energy that controlled the quick augmentation of space itself. This extension, called inflation, occurred so quickly that it generally settled the justification for all that would go on in a piece of a continuous space. It extended at fantastic rates until the development dialed back, and the energy changed into matter particles and the powers we think about as the Big Bang. But what was the nature of this energy? For what reason did it, from nowhere, encourage the universe, and why did it stop? Researchers accept that this unfathomable development made patches of the universe, each experiencing its own Big Bang. Imagine a fabric broadening constantly with tiny air bubbles forming, each air pocket representing a universe, including our own. This thought, called the inflationary multiverse, proposes that there are potentially impossible Big Bangs and an unfathomable number of universes. Our own is only one of many. This huge, mind-bending reality challenges how we could unravel the very universe itself and leaves us with the inquiry. What else is out there? The concept of nothingness before the Big Bang is hypothetical, not real, at least according to our current understanding. Regardless of whether you kill all energy, particles, and radiation from the universe, it would still not be truly void. Our universe is filled with dark matter, dark energy, quantum fields, and different forces that weave a specific woven tapestry of something without a doubt, even in its most empty construction. Whether or not we envision stripping away these forces, leaving a dead space, the universe would still create new types of energy. This, in itself, is confusing to researchers, as it suggests that true nothingness might be incomprehensible within our vast understanding. Space itself has properties, rules, and constants that keep it from being totally unfilled. Imagine creating a region with literally nothing in it. No particles, no radiation, 
and no negative energy, except for quantum fields and enormous constants. These would still exist, proposing that this nothingness has properties. For example, there's an idea called zero-point energy, which addresses the most inconceivable energy condition of quantum fields. In this state, particles can still appear and dissipate, creating a shocking resonance of progress, even in what should be empty space. This challenges our concept of a genuine void and suggests that, yes, even before the Big Bang, there was something. Experts are still evaluating this. Possibly one of the most amazing hypotheses in current cosmology is the chance of undying development. If inflation could create our universe, it's conceivable it could go on ceaselessly. Brian Cox describes a remarkably titanic inflationary multiverse where universes are unfathomably created and grow. Imagine each Big Bang as a flash lighting one more universe, while inflation occurs in various districts, creating countless other universes. This cycle could, in principle, happen forever. This thought of gigantic universes siring others leads to an enchanting concept of a fractal universe, where each new universe may, in fact, create its own Big Bang. Each universe exists as an alternate, independent space, unaffected by the others. Considering the rapid expansion of space, for scientists, this theory is both thrilling and disturbing, as it proposes an endless multiverse with no clear start or end. Imagine our universe being only a speck in a giant. Unlimited arrangement, continually creating and continuously making new universes. Imagine a scenario in which that is the real essence of reality. There is no previously or later, yet rather an undying example of universes framing how we could decipher nothingness. Changes when we consider quantum field hypothesis. As exhibited by this hypothesis, the universe isn't simply a blend of issue drifting in space. Maybe it's a convoluted association of energy handles that fill the universe, associating to make all that we notice. These fields are like substantial oceans, with particles going about as waves or unsettling influences. In any event, when fields are at their least energy level, known as the vacuum state, they are still dynamic. Particles can show up and vanish in these fields expeditiously, acquiring energy prior to bringing it back. This trademark prompts virtual particles, substances that right away exist and then evaporate, leaving just a faint memory of their presence. The concept of virtual particles challenges the credibility of a genuine void. Imagine an unfilled universe where all matter, radiation, and energy are taken out. Would you have, in fact, nothing? According to quantum field hypothesis, you wouldn't. Indeed, even in a vacuum, fields would remain dynamic, sometimes making transient particles. This consistent advancement in what ought to be nothing suggests that the universe doesn't maintain our idea of void. The fields and powers persevere, filling the universe with private energy that forestalls absolute nothing. This grasping raises an interesting question. Assuming that fields make particles and particles make matter, could the genuine universe have emerged from this nothingness, loaded up with quantum fields? Dark energy is an odd power that as of now drives the accelerated expansion of our universe. Anyway, did dark energy exist before the Big Bang? As indicated by certain viewpoints, the truth that dark energy exists today is a delayed consequence of an energy field from before our universe's advancement. The properties of dark energy appear to propose a giant secret power that may have existed in some form before the Big Bang. A few theories suggest that dark energy, in a much stronger state, might have controlled the inflationary stage, causing quick development. The presence of dark energy suggests that, whether our universe were discharged of all matter and radiation, this power would proceed to foster the outer layer of space-time. This thought prompts a disturbing question. If dark energy was present before the Big Bang, could it have ultimately shaped the circumstances that prompted the introduction of our universe? Might dark energy at any point be the peaceful planner of expansion, or even the genuine start of our universe? As we examine this plausibility, we face the capability of dark energy not simply as a force forming our universe, but as a key that could open the mysteries of the multiverse itself. Another hypothesis is cyclic cosmology which offers an option to the Big Bang as a conclusive starting. This hypothesis proposes that the universe goes through massive patterns of birth, demise, 
and restoration. In this model, the Big Bang is certainly not a one-time occasion, but may be part of an undying cycle where universes foster, isolate, and then recuperate in another cycle. This hypothesis suggests that our universe might have been re-established from the remainders of a past universe. The cycle of pressure and development in a cyclic example would mean that there was never a genuine start, but instead an everlasting series of universes arising, making, and restoring themselves over and over. Cyclic cosmology raises significant inquiries, no time like the present, as it suggests that time itself could rehash instead of continue. If this hypothesis is right, it could mean that what existed before the Big Bang was essentially one more form of the universe, one that fell exclusively to bring forth our current universe. For researchers, this hypothesis offers a rich answer to the question of extreme beginnings, suggesting that there is no clear start. The universe has consistently existed in some form, rising above our viewpoints of time and presence. Gravitational waves are another fascinating concept that could shed light on what existed before the Big Bang. These waves, discovered in 2015, are expansions in space-time brought about by unimaginably monstrous items like black holes or impacting neutron stars. These waves can travel significant distances, conveying information about the events that made them. Could gravitational waves give information about the introduction of the universe? A couple of physicists propose that gravitational waves coming from the time before the Big Bang might give insight into the condition of the universe before expansion began. Gravitational waves from the early universe may leave pieces of information that could help understand whether the Big Bang was genuinely the beginning or whether there were enormous events before that we don't yet grasp. These waves could be traces abandoned by events past our standard understanding. Their presence could also imply a greater construction beyond the universe we are familiar with. These weak signs could open bits of information that could change our perspective, just as we found the Big Bang start. Imagine a scenario in which they show the faint hints of a past universe or an event that occurred prior to the Big Bang. As researchers continue to investigate the profound spans of space, the question remains, what existed prior to the Big Bang? With current speculations highlighting quantum mechanics, multiverses, and the enormous expansion, it seems we are closer than ever to revealing the profound secrets of the universe's origins. While the complete response remains slippery, our understanding of what existed before the Big Bang continues to develop with each discovery. As we explore these speculations, we can also consider how they may fit together to reveal the bigger picture, the real essence of presence itself. However, until that time, we are left with the mystery, driving science and wonder into unknown places far beyond what we have yet known.